Kong is a dynamic and thriving global city. It plays an important role in China's Guangdong, Hong Kong, Macau, Greater Bay Area. Located on the northwestern corner of the territory, the Deep Bay Wetland is a recognized wetland of international importance under the Ramsar Convention. Its high ecological value is also important to the ecosystem of the Pearl River estuary. It houses the city's largest intertidal mudflat, with crucial marine habitats like mangroves, oyster beds, and soft shores that support rich biodiversity and is a primary feeding ground for thousands of migratory birds. Many people know oysters as food, but less known is the fact that they also form habitat and are the ecosystem engineers of bays and estuaries. Oyster reefs play an important role in coastal protection, improving water quality, and supporting marine biodiversity. Development brings increasing environmental challenges. Oyster reefs were once widely distributed in Hong Kong waters, but a lot of this habitat has been lost due to decades of commercial dredging for lime, reclamation, and water pollution. To address this loss, TNC has started to work on oyster restoration in Hong Kong, to bring back the ecological benefits they provide. You know, I've been involved in well over 150 projects, so this oyster reef restoration is not new. We've had a lot of uh, opportunity to experiment, to see what works, what doesn't work, and how to scale it up. The Nature Conservancy is working with the uh, University of Hong Kong to conduct the first Hong Kong study on the local ecological benefits of oyster reefs. Uh, this research has provided us guidance on our restoration efforts, which focus on enhancing biodiversity, increasing fish production, and educating the public about the importance of marine habitats. One of the exciting things that we discovered last year is that the oysters in Hong Kong actually has filtration rates amongst the highest in the world. Deep Bay also supports a long tradition of oyster farming which is now threatened due to environmental degradation in the area. With state-of-the-art purification technology, oyster aquaculture offers one of the most sustainable sources of food and the potential to help address conservation challenges while providing jobs in coastal communities. Our goal is to empower local stewardship and help build a sustainability vision for the Bay. We hope that the restoration work here will help inspire other projects in the Pearl River Delta, further expanding the benefits to nature and people.